Hi, I'm Pete with Greenhouse Pest Management. We are Atlanta's true natural pest control company. Avoiding bed bugs is almost like avoiding the plague. It's, it's, it's going to happen. They're going to they're be in schools, hotels, uh, kids' sleepovers. If you're staying over at a, a, at a cousin's house, it's, it's just going to happen. But the best ways to do it, as I do it when I go out of town, is check the mattresses thoroughly, okay? So some of the things that we're going to look for um, on a mattress is uh, fecal matter. Uh, uh, bed bugs leave fecal matter, um, which is basically just blood crystals that they leave behind, okay? So one of the key things is to look, uh, the first things is to actually look in, on, the, on the actual sheet itself that the, that the person's sleeping on and see if we can find any, can, any kind of fecal matter on here. Uh, if there's no fecal matter on here, the next step to do is to actually uh, take this sheet off and start looking along the seams of the uh, mattresses itself. And eventually, we might find some clusters um, of bed bugs if it's if it's a huge population. If not, we'll, we'll definitely find uh, droppings all along the edge of this thing. Okay, the best things to do when you're doing an inspection is that bed bugs come out at night while you're sleeping. Okay, so they really hide themselves during the day. So the key things are looking throughout the mattress thoroughly, the actual box springs itself, headboards, lampshades. Uh, curtains, anywhere that a bed bug can hide, okay, because it will be beyond the actual uh, bed itself, okay?